back to the Russia investigation and the potential investigations from the now democratically uh, democratic majority in Congress. Some say that you could stop all this by declassifying. I could. I could, st I could fire everybody right now, but you, I don't want to stop it because politically I don't like stopping it. Yeah. Uh, it's a disgrace. It should have never been started because there was no crime. Uh, it is — everybody has conflicts. They all have conflicts over there that are uh, beyond anything that anybody's ever seen in terms of conflicts, uh, from uh, the fact that people ask for jobs, from the fact that they have very good friends on the other side, like — really good friends like Comey, who, by the way, lied and leaked, and also leaked classified information. Nothing happened there. It might, perhaps. Maybe something's happening that I don't know about. I stay away from it. But you know what I do? I let it just go on. They're wasting a lot of money, but I let it go on because I don't want to do that. But you're right. I could end it right now. I could say that investigation is over. But it's, it's really um, — it's a disgrace, frankly. And it's an embarrassment to our country. It's an embarrassment to the people of our country. And it's too bad. Go ahead. What about the de de declassification of the documents? Some say that that would clear well, it all up. We're looking at that. No, You're no, still we're looking at it? that very seriously. Declassification. Okay. We're looking yep. at very seriously. Okay. Can I ask one more question? It's amazing how people on the other side just don't want those documents declassified. But no, we're looking at that very carefully. And I certainly wanted to wait till after the midterms. Can I ask you one more question, Mr. President? Okay. Thank you. Go ahead.